you don't know the shade of a tree until it's been cut down. Yes, so you will not know the color. Don't worry. <laughs> hey, come and visit me. Come and visit me. Or come and live with me. Are two different things. Know the difference and have peace. Hello, everybody. Welcome to my channel. Is your favorite baby boo? I appreciate you guys. You guys are the real MVP. Happy Sunday. Yes, so. Most people around the world are still in Sunday. Some are leaving, some are entering. But we, we are like have to do right now in this part of the world. So my people, it has happened. It has happened. Only of if have called on Deji of Akure because Deji of Akure is one man that uh, Naomi respects so much. So only of if now felt, okay, I can't do this alone. So let me call people that this person um respect. You understand? Um, and one thing I want to let you people know is that it's hard. Men are actually slower to fully recover from heartbreak than women. You understand? Especially when a man loves you like KBAC. When a man gives his all, a man gives his emotion, his potential, his value, his love, his life, everything that man has. So right now, as it is right now, um, KBAC has given his... KBAC, Naomi, Naomi is the first woman he has loved more than his children. I think he loves Naomi so much that he can't even explain how he loves Naomi. You understand? So right now... Only of if I have called the Jovakure and the Jovakure told uh, only of if I sorry for what is going on. And the Jovakure said he actually saw this sign coming because when he was asking KBAC all the things Naomi's family has you to do, did you do them? He said he's going to do them. Are the Olori still in the palace? He said yes, the Olori is in the palace, but they've moved to the Olori quarters. You understand? And the Jovakure said he actually warned him and said, that wasn't the deal, and he said he's going to deal with it one thing at a time. You understand? They say time is the greatest healer, but KBSC right now say that is not in his dictionary. So as it is right now, KBSC have called on the Jovakure to um beg Naomi to come back to him, please. That he knows that Naomi listened to the Jovakure. The Jovakure is one person that have been uh, opinionated in this matter. He loves Naomi. He loves KBSC, and he's somebody that have been telling KBSC over and over again that please, um bring back Naomi, bring back Naomi. And Oni is looking at a way that we'll be able to overcome this pain. And how will he overcome this pain if he doesn't do the needful? Yes, he has failed. Which, is, which he has acknowledged that he has failed, you understand? But right now, it's not the time to apportion blame. It's the, pan, it's the time to see how he can overcome the pain, how he can bring back Naomi to his life. So right now, Oni told the Jabakure that for the first time, he cried because of a woman. For the first time, he shed tears. That for the first time, now he truly knows that he has lost a rare gem. He has lost a jewel. He has loved the love of his life. And he's having this feeling that Naomi might not come back to him again. That is what the Jovakure is and Oni of Ife is saying. That he's having this feeling that he might not have Naomi back again. And anything that will make him not to have Naomi back, that he doesn't want that, that um, that is going to suffer Shege Banzao, that if Naomi don't come back, that every other person will receive moto moto from inside you understand that he wants to protect naomi he wants to protect his love that it's not for naomi keep increasing every day that even at this moment people uh, people are trying to say him leave naomi he said he cannot leave naomi that he cannot leave naomi that, that if, if, he has not seen people that will convince him after all this thing that happened it was all his fault that is because him he wasn't initiating his own part of the deal. Naomi have done her own part of the deal, and Naomi felt, oh, if you cannot do this little tuna ask you, I cannot trust you, and that was why Naomi left. So right now, Dejo Fakure has been able to reach out to Naomi, and Naomi told him, please, it's for my own good. Is I'm I'm having physical pain, I'm having spiritual pains, I'm having emotional pain. I'm like somebody that has been hit from a three-story building. You understand? It's as if there's something hit me from two-story building, and I'm yet to recover. And, and I, I'm strong right now. I'm strong. So now the Jovakure, Naomi that told the Jovakure, I respect you so much, sir. But at this point, if I were your sister, will you tell me to go back? And uh, the Jovakure was very quiet. He was mute. He couldn't say anything because he didn't see that question coming from Queen Naomi. Queen Naomi told him, no, let's be realistic. If I were your sister, will you tell me to go to KBAC? Will you tell me to go back when those women were there? Will you tell me to go that even in when I have not come to this house, he cannot fulfill his bargain. He cannot um, keep to his promise. Is it when I leave the house that he's going to keep to his promise? You understand? I'm trying to heal. I know it's a healing process. I'm trying to heal, but 
Kabiesi did not try. Yes, we are mutual friends, we are family friends and all that. But uh, this 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 heartbreak is permanent. Oh, he broke my heart first. As of 24 hours, I called him, we talked, I asked him so many things. Oni was just interested in marriage, marriage. Maybe Oni want to marry me to pepe people. But me, Naomi said she, she doesn't want to marry Oni to pepe anybody. She wants to marry Oni because she wants them to maintain their love. She wants them to be in a lovely relationship. She wants them to be together because that is what God said. Because it has been destined that Kabi Esi and Naomi will be together. That is their destiny. That they have to be together. But right now, the way KBAC is going about it, KBAC was just doing it anyhow. Like, Naomi does not have an option. Naomi will care. According to Naomi, Naomi told Deji of Akure that Oni did not prioritize her. That with all the bad dreams she was having, that in short, Naomi said, she, she, not, she not even coming to the palace is, is for the good of KBAC. That's what Naomi said. Is that she not even coming for the palace? That Kabiesi did not know that she has done Kabiesi a whole lot of good. That is for the good of Kabiesi. Because a lot of things would have happened to Kabiesi. You. Hmm. you cannot fatten a pig on the market day. It's not the day you want to go and sell the pig, you fatten it. It doesn't happen. Naomi said what happened would have stayed happen. That if she has come to that palace, if they cannot get her, they will get Kabiesi so that she will be held responsible. But she said no. Even KBAC know all these things. That the Jubakure should have asked KBAC how many warning the Brazilian Sia, the Indian Sia, the, the Ife priest, everything that they've been telling Oni back to back things that will happen. But Oni of Ife never told her anyone. Oni of Ife was taking everything for granted. Look at it right now. Just look at it right now. Look at where they are. Something they would have done and gone past it. But KBAC was busy drawing his leg. Who is KBAC trying to please for goodness sake? The Jofakoria now told Naomi that let her not be angry, that they, let her see how they can walk through it because truly, truly, yes, that Naomi have even tried for Naomi to say she wants to come back, that Naomi have really, really tried, that they applaud her for that. You understand? They applaud her. But Naomi should just think about it. Let her try and give only of Fife a second chance. That is not easy. They know that it's not easy. But whatever it is, Naomi should try and give only of Fife a second chance. And Naomi told uh, Jeju Vakure, I'm actually talking to you. The next time you call me, my phone is off. So I'm talking to you, my phone is off. Spiritually, I'm happy right now. Physically, I'm happy right now. Emotionally, I'm happy right now. Me and KBSC will co-parent. We'll be friends. We'll love our children. You understand? We love our children. Nothing will happen. But you see any other thing? I don't want right now. Let me focus on myself. Focus on my God. Focus on my second chance that the Lord has given me. Kai, 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 kai. They say if you listen to the voice of the market, you won't buy you. Naomi, if you listen to the voice of people, you won't do what is in your mind. Do what is in your mind. And we've said it before that no matter what Naomi do, no matter what Naomi will do, we are supporting her hundred percent. And that is on period. See you guys later. Now do it to subscribe, like, comment, and bye for now. Please pray for Naomi. It's not easy. And still pray for KBSC too. It's not easy. Last last. You guys get it now. See you guys later now. Bye for now.